Hey there, my name is Mars and welcome back to Amnesia Machine for Pig. Okay, we got a note here left by our piggy friend. There's a spoon of medicine, I say, and it's a silver spoon, what you did get born holding. Ever so painful for mummy dear, but grasped so hard it was a little screaming red fist. Later you use your spoon to dig a hole in the garden to get the all the way to Mexico. And then you did eat worms with the your spoon on the way to stay fat. This spoon was the same you gave your twins. Then you used it to dig a hole into their clockwork soles. And you ate their, up their hearts like soup on the way to keep you fat. Fat little mole, where, you, where will you dig next, I ask. You and your little silver spoon made from the silver spine of your children. And wrapped in the hair of your dearly departed. Dear sweet Jesus, darling little Beth, what have I become? What have I become? What the hell did I do with these kids and stuff? Man, oh man. This guy got a history you wouldn't believe! You know, a while back I played a um, uh, an alpha game of uh, SCP-015, I think it was, and that was all about a um, like a sentient uh, uh, pipe system, which constantly was growing by all the materials it found in the surroundings, including human uh, tissue. And I would imagine it would look like some something like this. Okay, there's steam over there. I need to shut that off before I can get to that. Got enough. Oh boy, if the force of my evil sent my children into pipes to clean them, it seems likely there's another entrance I can use to escape this noxious maelstrom of vengeance. I will ignore the burning in my nostrils for the from the fumes that the godless compound X that fuels these machines and I will become the saboteur. I will destroy the pressure systems, enabling to me to enter the pipes without fear. Oh, I got this one. So it's done. The saboteur was me and the voices on the telephone was him. But what of us? How do we connect? Surely I cannot be responsible for all I see about me. I can remember. I cannot remember. I cannot remember. All I can grasp is a moment when the world split into two pieces and the innards of humanity fell from the orifice thorn get him into my open Wilfutric heart. There's a lot more notes in this one, and they're not uh, in the memoirs. Aren't really go there or this is broken, fix it or something like that. It's it's much more poetic. I really like that. Okay, I don't think I can go in there. It seems kind of uh, hot and steamy. So we need to find a way to actually switch this off. Danger! Ensure conduits are correctly placed to avoid pressure backdrafts. Child fatality this month's 17. Holy shit. Hey! Yeah! Fuck you. I don't think the machine liked that. I think I pissed it off a bit. Can I go through here now? <coughs> no, no, ho, ho, ho. Oh, is All about me, the thunder, uh, thunder of machinery, the blast of boiling steam. I cannot pass without fear of scalding. I am a lobster, cracked, my circulation stagnated, my vital motions impended. The steam will boil my hole unless I find a way to shut it off. Uh, why do I keep getting two notes? It seems the pressure system is indeed the Achilles heel of this facility. See, uh, something I clearly did not realize in my first clumsy attempts at sabotage. If I rerouted the steam, I can wreak havoc. Oh, okay, so I need another pipe. That sounds interesting. I need another pipe. I need another pipe. Here we go. Go. I can pick that up. 
whoa, 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 whoa. Maybe destro destroying this thing while I'm still in it isn't a good idea. Have you thought of that, you idiot? Whoa, Danelli! Whoa! Can I? No. Okay. Okay, it's still coming down. Need to find another. Hold on. Ah, there we go. Jeez, man! Some form of steam regulator. I wager if I disable it, the damage caused by the rushing steam pressure could be catastrophic. Certainly enough to force the temporal stalling of this entire engine. That should cause the steam pressure to drop. Man, is you clever little old goat. I can feel this horror, this grief, this betrayal boil into fury. I will not stand, I will not be under thrown. If this machine is to is my heirloom, I, will, I am the overman. Overman. Get close. Oh boy, there's a piggy. There's a piggy. And there's a piggy. And there's a piggy. And there's a ladder, which I'm going up. Fuck you, piggies. Holy crap, they're big piggies. Okay, let me now quickly through the pipes before the pressure returns and they fill with boiling corrosive steam. I sense the machine snarls it itself about me. Its unholy inhuman mind calls and slicks and sends the dark tendrils through its conduits to repair the damage. I will return to the streets. I will fetch help. I shall lead the people upon the factory, burn it to the ground, and seal this evil place underground forever. Gotta run. Gotta drop. Ow! 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 ow. Geronimo! Ow! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Go up, you stupid bloody asshole! This is your doom, Mandus. This is what you dreamt it to be. I will stop you. I will save them. You are too late. It begins. My work has begun. Kill them, my piggies! Kill them all! Oh, but no! I think I released the piggies. Send in the pigs. Oh boy. I think I may have done something bad. Anything to save them. You profit my viscera. We will make you escape forever. You slit the throat, the throat, bleed out the pig and release its curdle. That you set your species free. Oh boy. Somehow I don't think that people would want to help me seeing I did all this stuff in the first place. Maybe they'll destroy the factory but not at my command. <laughs> we'll be set in prison or hung or burned at a stake, I don't know. I won't go quietly, that's for sure. Alrighty. Up we go. I've got a feeling I have to uh, work my way around more piggies. Soon. Wanna get out of here? Let me let me go. Let me go. Let me go. What the hell is going on at the top so high? What's going on? That sounds like cannon fire. Whatever was set in motion was 
is going on. No soliciting, no hawking, no begging. Forgive me, what I've, uh, what have, I, what I have unleashed. I stand and smell the burning city. I see ash upon the wind. I hear the roars of the sickening beast and screams as they fall upon the city and drag the, its people below for slaughter. Now I begin to understand what the other composite ingredient of compound X must be, and I also understand this. It is my responsibility now. I must find a way back to the heart of the machine and complete what I've started. And we got another note! We have set aside the entire wing of the mansion for the, their parties. We invite them from near and far and we guzzle them into the fine wine and the finest cup in all of London. My god, Mandus. But these chops are rather divine. Who is your butcher? Feed them up from wine and the grains will also lend a character to the product. Keep the flesh relaxed. Opium in the champagne and gravy. Wait, what? I killed my guest? Ew. A hog roasted every night for the Duke and the Duchess. An actress battered in slice. The fuck? An artist in, the e in every mouthful. And then reportedly in the finest tea stewed in his own leaves. They bicker and breathe under the table by the fireplace, on the carpet stained with wine and fat, while long dead nobles and deformed grace and cold stare watch them from gilded frames along the crooked walls. We will hose it down later as we shovel them into our machine. Fuck! I like this guy even less than it already did. This is fucked up. 